we're back with another ultimate team video ultimate freeze finally came our way in the form of uh really not too much exciting content to start but of course it always gets better and better with every passing day when it comes to ultimate freeze ghosts of madden and out of position are going to be coming probably in the coming weeks i assume out of position next week and then uh, ghosts of madden past future and present coming the week after that so it is going to be fun it's going to be a lot of content they basically already came out and said that Mahomes will be coming during this promo as well we did get a Justin Houston today too so uh, we're going to be trying to get him in the team we're going to be opening some packs today and then doing a gameplay with Justin on Wednesday he does have a run stopper uh, archetype so he's going to be able to get run stuffing chems at a pretty low cost so it might be a good spot to put in at DT I know Frank Clark for a lot of people has already been kind of that guy at DT so we'll see We'll have him powered up probably by the end of this video, and uh, we'll be going through all the fun stuff that he's going to bring with him as well. So, without further ado, don't forget to sub to the channel if you're new around here. Don't forget to hit that like button as well as ring the notification bell to, bell, to, bell to be notified every single time I upload a video. That was a struggle to get through, and uh, yeah, we'll just hop into it. All right, so we've got 14 packs. I kind of bought the smaller bundle. This team standout fantasy pack, to be honest, uh, is probably just going to be a training quick sell for me so i'm gonna take oh is it gonna be the okay we might have to see what power up's going for the most then uh but we got 10k worth of snow because uh, if, if that's gonna give me the power up too might as well try and make the most coins out of it that i can why is it why not just have it be a 5,000 snow quick sell thing why, why is it five one thousands? That uh, seems wildly unnecessary, but uh, the animation's kind of cool. Uh, we'll see if a big pull is any different. I assume it will be. Uh, so we're going to do this 85 plus pack. And then we will get into the other packs. So we got an 89 out of it. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, we got our welcome pack, which is going to be a, uh, I think, Derrick Henry and... Uh, a tip to uh, get rid of so we got 500 stuff from Derek doesn't want to uh, give us any of that stuff I think I have enough cards in my binder as well to do uh, some presents so I might make some presents out as well cut to that we got Robert Tanyan in our first pack so that's kind of a letdown Another elite Zach Ertz. I doubt his value is going to be that high though, even though he is. He got an 85, not bad. One of the 93s. Because I don't know who really wants a Zach Ertz card right now. Especially with uh, Johnny Smith being a card that's coming out. Or available, I should say. Matt Judon. We got our freeze card. 87 Carson Wentz. The benched Wentz. Jalen Hurts played well yesterday though. So, I mean, getting a dub over New Orleans. Got Juwan Bentley. Another team standout. Be a 92. 89 Kamara. Got our ice coming in. 83 Cody Whitehair. A Legends piece. Which is always helpful since uh, you're going to need a whole bunch of 86s and 87s for these sets. Got Trayvon Mullen. Another 85. I got to stop skipping that animation. I like, don't see it right at the beginning. So I think like I still got a button over for some reason. I want to pull a big boy though. Debo, another elite. Jimmy G, Niners, Niners theme pack here. And I'm gonna think a smaller one. Yep. Yeah. There's gotta be some different with the big ones, but we'll have to find out. At least we're getting like elites in this. I mean, even if it is just an 80, I think you need uh you need some 80s and such for the uh the you gotta think present packs which i mean i'm gonna try and get as many presents as i can so we're definitely going to be uh using all of these cards that i've had stocked up in a binder for a while to get presents we got another 87 how many more i think we got one more pack and then we got the standout fantasy pack which uh if it does give uh oh hey 93 i didn't see anything different in the animation so that's not not a great sign and we got 88 Lance Allworth which is awesome alright we will go check on that 
fantasy stuff later. I'm gonna go see if I can't make a couple of uh, Christmas presents real quick and then we'll open those and kind of speculate about them. So give me a second. In 87, 88. Oh, why did I open it? Silly me. Okay, well, I, I completed one. We're gonna see if we can get a large present. We got an extra large present. Hell yeah. Okay, I accidentally opened that, but it was a good result. 36,000 snow. Um, black and red, I can't really. Doesn't really let you. I mean, I'll, I'll blow it up in Photoshop and stuff later. And we might just do a guessing presents video, but black and red uh, could be Texans, could be Chiefs, could be a uh, football team. I mean, I'm trying to think like what most likely. I mean, it could be nine. Like any team with red, really. <sighs> so I don't know. We'll see. Let me uh, try and complete this other medium or better. We got Chill Factor rank up as well. So that's good. All right, so we got two random presents and a medium or better present because I'm dumb. Actually, we're just gonna we're just gonna go and get training for this. If it uh, gives us the power up, it gives us the power up. That's fine. So 10k training, Cordero. Probably if anyone at Marcus Davenport would have been the best one to grab. So let's uh, open a few with training first because we do have I think 10 random presents with training. Yes, so we will open three here, see what we get out of this. We're going to probably just be shooting to have like extra large and large presents, so as we get another large present, uh, probably a Viking of some sort, if I had to guess. No, I should have seen how much large presents quick sell for. So we can probably see kind of about what they quick sell for in the store. Then we got... A small present so small presents quick sell for 900 snow and we got one more training roll for presents here and we get another small present so that's the same small present we just got I am glad that they went and made uh, all the stuff open at the same time that was good to see um, we got okay we got to go to the binder that's right so we got two medium or biggers and uh or no one random one medium or bigger and two randoms so we got two more randoms and a medium or bigger so we'll end on the medium or bigger hopefully we can get some extra larges we get another extra large this is almost certainly going to be a stealer so we got one one stealer one possibly chief so far the extra large presence and our next random is Another small, so we've gotten that same small present three times now. And now our medium or bigger pre present, we've got a medium present coming our way. So I'm just going to wrap this up for the uh, the bit. We will also go and get Justin Houston, of course. I'm going to go get him and get him powered up and show you guys before we head out here in this video. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys on Wednesday for a gameplay then. And uh, hopefully get a dub with Justin Houston, maybe with run stopper cams in the interior. So... Let me go get Justin Houston powered up and all that fun stuff, and uh, we'll get into it. All right, so we're back. We got Justin. Last thing before we end this video, uh, he's got 88 speed, 93 excel, 87 strength, 98 tackling, 99 play rec, 83 and 83 for power move and finesse, 92 block shed. It is kind of tough that for whatever reason, they really didn't upgrade his power moves and finesse moves for uh, his card, but I mean, he's going to be pretty solid there in the middle. I mean, a little underweight, of course, but... Uh, he does get run stopper cams, so he should be a very decent option to put in there. We'll see how much. Uh, in so inside stuff is going to cost you two AP, just like Frank does, since he's a power rusher. So both of them uh, can get in there and uh, be pretty solid DT options for you in stopping the run and getting through and be quick options. They're both about 88 speed. I think Frank might be a little bit quicker, but uh, yeah, both good options. That's going to wrap things up here for me, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, we did get the lineup video fixed. I'm sorry that that had an issue in it. I didn't notice I hadn't adjusted the audio levels in that. So sorry it took until Saturday to get it done. But again, I was moving this weekend. So we are kind of moved in a little bit now. And uh, we are good to uh, start recording and doing stuff again. So hope you guys did enjoy the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Saying who that over there looking a whole snack.